Let's take a look at how to interpret charts to find the mean, median, mode, and range. Lily takes attendance of how many students are in her class each day. What is the range of the data set? Okay, well range, remember, is always the largest number minus the smallest number. So if I look in my table, the biggest number is eight. Now there's a few of them, but eight is still the biggest number. The smallest number is one. So to find the range, I would say, okay, my biggest number of eight minus my smallest number of one. And that's gonna give me a range of seven. Samantha logs her runs from day to day. What is the mode of the numbers? Okay, well mode is the most common number or the number that appears the most frequently. If you look at your table, 10 comes up twice. It's the only number that appears twice. So your most common number or your mode would be 10. Dylan collects data on how many times he leaves the house each day. Find the mode by using the data below. Round to one decimal, please. Okay, well the mode is the most common number or the number that appears the most frequently. So if I look at my list, I can see three shows up twice. Every other number is only in the list one time. So my mode or my most common number is three. Madison takes attendance of how many students are in her class each day. What is the range of the data set? Round to one decimal place. Okay, well it doesn't look like we're gonna need decimal places here. We have whole numbers. So let's see, the range is the biggest number minus the smallest. So if I scan my table, the biggest number is six minus the smallest number is one. So six minus one is gonna give me a range of five. Caitlin kept track of how fast she could bike to school. Find the mean by using the data below. Okay, the mean is the average. To find that, you're gonna add up all your numbers and divide by how many numbers there are. So if I add up all my numbers, I'm gonna say eight plus zero plus eight plus eight plus one. Okay, so notice I'm just adding all of these numbers, eight plus zero plus eight plus eight plus one. Now you divide by how many numbers there are. Well, there were one, two, three, four, five numbers, so I'm gonna divide that by five. Okay, so first we're gonna add eight plus zero plus eight plus eight plus one is gonna give me 25, and since there were five numbers, I have to divide that by five well, that works out evenly. 25 divided by five gives me five. So that would be my mean or my average, five. Ethan collected data on how many pets his friends had. Find the median by using the data below. Okay, well the median is the middle number when your numbers are listed from least to greatest. So if I look at my table, I wanna start by putting these numbers in order. Right, two, then two. My next smallest number would be four, then five, then eight. Okay, for the median, the middle number. Well, my middle number is four, so that would be the median. Luke has kept track of how many Halloween candies he has gotten every year. What is the range of the data below? round to a decimal place. Okay, well the range is the biggest minus the smallest number. My biggest number is 10, minus my smallest number is five. So when I subtract 10 minus five, that's gonna give me a range of five. Kevin takes attendance of how many students are in his class each day. What is the range of the data set? Okay, well the range is the biggest minus the smallest. So it looks like my biggest number here is six and my smallest number is zero. So six minus zero is gonna give me a range of six.
Kevin has kept track of how many Halloween candies he's gotten. What is the mode of the data below? Okay, well, the mode is the most common number or the number that appears the most frequently. So notice three comes up in the list twice. Everything else is only in the list one time. So our mode or most common number is three. Jack logs his runs from day to day. What is the mode of the numbers? Okay, so again, we're looking for the most common number, 9, 0, 10, 10, and 6. So 10 shows up twice, making it the mode or the most common.